welcome back to learn by Raul and today we are going to discuss about very important red model red is a stand for rapid application development it is a type of incremental model let me take one very simple example to understand red model suppose your mobile microphone is not working so you go to mobile repair shop and say to my microphone is not working so he just take the microphone and replace the microphone or he repair the microphone he doesn't worry about your mobile camera is working or not your mobile display is working or not so this is what process we can easily understand red model process so red model or rapid application development model is a software development process based on prototyping without any specific planning in red model there is less attention paid to the planning and more priority is given to the development task it target at developing software in a short span of time or we can say there is a less long term planning involved in the process and more focus is paid to the adoptability of the development workflow so let's understand advantages of red model first reduce development time it is adoptable and flexible to changes it is useful when you have to reduce the overall project risk integration from very beginning solve a lot of integration issues it is easier to transfer deliverables as scripts it increases the reusability of features due to prototype in nature there is a possibility of laser defects and the last each phase in red delivers highest priority functionality to the customer now let's discuss about this advantages of red model the first one is like all application is not compatible with red it can't be used for smaller projects reduce features due to time boxing where features are Post to a later version to finish a release in short period. The third required user involvement requires highly skilled designer or developers. When technical risk is high, it is not suitable. The last management complexity is more high dependency on modeling skills. Now we talk about when red model should be followed. The first when a system needs to be produced in a short span of time like two or three months when a budget is high enough to afford designer for modeling along with the cost of automated tools for code generation third one is when the user will be involved all through the life cycle fourth is when a technical risk is less when the requirement are known and the last when there is a necessary to create a system that can be modularize in three to four months or two or three months of time so thank you this is all about red model and if you have any query you can comment below and for the more updates and videos you can subscribe my channel thank you